Hello, this is Babak Darvish, and I'll be reading from the book Music of the Soul by Sheikh Muhammad Al Jamal Arifai Al Shazli. Today's lesson will be the knowledge of the Sufi path. This book, uh, Music of the Soul, uh, Sufi Teachings, is an introduction to the teachings of the guide of the peace and the love and mercy to the way of Allah through the religion of unity in the Sufi way from Sidi Sheikh Muhammad Al-Jamal Arifai Ashazali. May Allah be pleased with him. The Sheikh Al-Qutb al qawth is the guide of the Shazli path, the Sufi path founded by the master and guide Sheikh Ali Abu al-Hassan al-Shazli in Egypt in the 13th century. In his body, the Sheikh is a descendant of the Prophet Muhammad. May Allah's uh, peace and blessings be upon him. Through his ancestor, the Sheikh Ahmad Arifai, in his spirit he is the inheritor through the Shazali line from his guide and master, the Qutb al Qawth. Um, the Sheikh Abdul Rahman Abu Risa al Halab in the land of Syria. The Sheikh has been living on the Mount of Olives in the holy city of Jerusalem since the year 1959. He has been the Imam and central figure at the Masjid al Aqsa or the Dome of the Rock for many years. The teaching from his spirit is very deep. And for all those who have a heart and who listen with this heart, his teaching sheds an entirely new light on the reality of Sufism and the significance of carrying this message to everyone in this time. For many years, the Sheikh has been a teacher at the Sacred Sanctuary of Al-Aqsa in Jerusalem, which is linked for all Muslims to the Holy House in Mecca and the tradition of the night journey or Al-Miraj of the Prophet Muhammad from the Kaaba in Mecca to the Al-Aqsa Mosque and from there to the heavens. The Sheikh is well known to many people both in Palestine and in other countries in the world. Uh, not only is he a teacher and a counselor for all those who come to be at Al-Aqsa, but he is also its custodian. For through his hand and leadership in these times, the sacred precinct has been preserved. In the face of many efforts to destroy it as a place of prayer for the Muslim people who come from all over the world to visit the holy city of Jerusalem and to take the blessing of the praying in this mosque. The Sheikh has students and followers in the Holy Land as well as in the or as in America and Europe, but it has only been since 1993 that the order came to his heart to travel to visit other countries. At the same time, the order came from Allah, from him, to give teachings to all those in every part of the world who are sincerely seeking for the truth of their existence, uh, the meaning of their life, and to heal their wounds. Up until then, the teaching had been reserved only for study in the Zawiya in Jerusalem. Um, all those who are aware that uh, the suffering and sickness in this world is not of a material nature, but of a spiritual nature, the medicine, as uh, Sidi indicates in his teaching, lies in the purification of the heart and the removing of the veils so that we may come to understand the wisdom of why he created us and brought us into this world. This is the path of all the prophets and messengers and the way of the return to a real life in the world of unity. This is the knowledge of the Sufi path and the science of Tasawwuf. This is the most important thing